Mark Twain once said that if you tell the truth, you don't have to remember anything. But in court, some witnesses may need help recalling specific facts, even if they are telling the truth. In Fisher v. Schwartz, we'll see whether a document that detailed a witness's past recollections could be admitted into evidence. A homeowner hired a contractor to repair his house. The contractor later sued the homeowner to recover costs for labor and materials. During his testimony at trial, the contractor, quote, refreshed his recollection, unquote, from a copy of an itemized bill that he sent to the homeowner. The homeowner retained the original copy of the bill. The bill contained a list of more than 100 items, and the contractor read from the list during his testimony. After the contractor testified, the contractor offered the bill into evidence. The homeowner objected, claiming that the bill wasn't admissible. The trial court admitted the itemized bill into evidence, and the court found in favor of the contractor. The homeowner appealed. 